tired of your posture not helping you in your presentations. Do you find it hard to explain them? Is it the first time you make a poster and you don't know how to start? We, we have, have a solution. solution! In this video we're going to show you how to make an effective poster and how to do a very excellent presentation. First of all, what is a poster? A poster is a very effective way to communicate your own research, idea or project to many, many, many different types of audiences. In this video, we're going to teach you how to make an effective poster and how to present it in an appealing way. First of all, we're going to go step by step. The first step is ask ourselves two questions. Where am I going to present it? It is important to take into account who the presentation is aimed at. That will give you the complexity of the explanation and then you will know how to attract the attention of the public. The second question we have to ask ourselves is, does the assembly of that poster have any requirements? We must always pay attention to the format that the organizers ask us. For example, size and type of font, colors, layout of text and images. And if they don't ask for any standard, we recommend you to look for some design to inspire you and be able to make your own. Organize. We are not going to design our poster yet. First, we have to combine the information we are going to use and adapt it to our audience. We shall look for the images, photos, drawings, graphics, the text and an interesting title. Step 3. Design. It's time to get creative. In this step we will put together our poster finally. If you have a format to respect, don't forget to do it. It all depends on how you want to put together your poster. But we leave here some tips and a little inspiration. Have the information well organized by sections, and that those sections are distinguished from one another. Don't write too much. Using keywords is always better than having a lot of text. Use creative graphics, for example drawings in PNG with transparent background and that they have a similar style between them. You can also use innovative elements, like QR codes that serve to complement the info, and you, if your poster is digital, you can also use videos, animations and audio. Use a color palette, take into account the contrast of the background with text and other shapes. Use readable text fonts, you can combine fonts and style using font sizes evenly. Leaving a border and distributing the sections in a spaced way gives a striking and neat design to your poster. Add contact information too, name of you or your institution and any means in which they can contact you. Use a program in which you feel comfortable to design it. Step 4. Verification. Try that the poster is understood and that it helps you when explaining it. Ask a friend or family member to give you their point of view, to know if it is understandable and visually appealing. Something that serves us is to study and study and practice before presenting. And also you can tell your own story and how did you came of what you did. When you are presenting your poster, try to make as real as possible. And also when you are practicing before the presentation. And also having a good poster that harmonizes with the audience and with the place you are presenting is neater and also striking. We hope you like our video. And we want to see your presentation in a global presentation, of course. 
Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And if you reach this part of the video, comment Buster with Mate's presentation of bosses.